Dr. Whit has seen the Hand Goblin. Cold. It's its Achilles heel. Now that we know the entity is alien, it initiates a different protocol. Lady, you are scaring me. We can't risk the entity getting out. So we contain it! Go! Listen to me. I am begging you. Whatever's inside that mammoth, it needs to be researched. It, it has unspeakable scientific value. We won't allow that. Okay, let's just cut the weak crap. Okay, there's no we in this situation. It's not for us to decide. Does she mean us or we? I think them. Could I be frank with you? You are frank. Excuse me? Oh. I told you I wasn't kidding about the phone book. Dad, where are you going? I need a drink. Dr. Abernathy. I don't hear Frank. you. Oh, God, will someone please tell Frank? her to shut up? Frank? Hey, Luce. Milkshakes all around? None for her, right there. Huh? Time waits for no man, Frank. Well, it can wait for me. You're putting everyone at risk. <sighs> I'm putting them at risk. Uh, let's get something straight, sister. And I want everyone here to be very clear on the dynamics of our exact situation. Scenario one, I help you kill the mammoth. We succeed and the government doesn't blow us up. Correct. Scenario two, I help you, we fail. And in, uh, well, what is it? It's a little less than uh, five hours and 52 minutes, everyone in this good town is dead. I don't like scenario two. Me neither. There's more. Scenario three. We go get my dad. And we celebrate my daughter's birthday. And we spend the last six hours of our existence doing something that matters. Amen to that. Thank you. That wouldn't be a good decision. At least it'd be my decision. Look. If I agree to to do this, to kill the mammoth. I want my family evacuated out of here immediately. Thank you, Liz. I can't offer you that. Mm. Well, then you can go to H-E double hockey sticks. OK, last chance, or I approach this on my own. A scenario that definitely lowers the odds. How much? Like, I'm talking 10, 15 percent. Frank! I need to speak with my daughter. Sweetie. There's some stuff that I've been wanting. It's, no, this is stuff that I need to say to you. I guess this is why you were late today. Oh. Yeah. I'm sorry I acted the way I no, did. No, hey, forget it. I mean, you had every right. I haven't been there for you. I. I've been hiding. I know words don't seem to mean too much right now, but I just, I need you to know that I'm proud of you. And I know if your mom were still here, she'd be proud of you too. Ever since your mom died, I've been overprotective of you. Let me tell you something, after today, the one thing I know is you're tough. Just like she was. Maybe even tougher. Which is why, um, I wanted you to have this uh, on your birthday.
Yeah, yeah, I gave it to her when we first met. I think it's time you wear it. It's your birthday. Tell me what you want me to do here. Ride the Tempest. Tame the waves, kill the sharks. What? It's a quote, Dad. The Vietnamese Joan of Arc. Oh. Oh, right. Yeah, of course it is. <laughs> I, I, I sent you to that private school. OK, uh, everybody. You don't want to help? I suggest you hold up here. They say you haven't really lived unless you've looked death in the face. I guess I'm going to live forever then. <laughs> What are you doing here? Whoa! The monkey's a guy! Um, right. We have an alien possessed mammoth on the loose, and if we don't stop it, the government's gonna kill all of us. All right, you're serious? I'm serious. Uh, I don't know quite what to do. What would Patrick McNee do here? He'd let him appeal drive. There you go. This Emma Peel Patrick McNee thing, I just, I don't get it. Obviously, you never watched The Avengers. Where'd they go? Don't worry, I know where we're going. Tell me about this mammoth. See for yourself. Hang on! What? We're on empty. What? Frank, I think we've got a problem. Where's Jack? Wait, 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 something's wrong. We gotta go back. What? We gotta go back! Okay. <laughs> you two just stay here, all right? Take this, keep an eye out. <laughs> scared squirrel. I'm really scared. Even Emma has a bad day every now and then. Uh, hmm. oh, hell with it. Buck needs a new kidney. <laughs> 